Hello world. How y'all doing today? How y'all doing this evening? How you doing tonight? Welcome to another installment and in what's that console? We are now in my favorite generation of gaming, the fifth generation. Um, first of all, the fifth generation took a lot of notes from the fourth generation. With the fourth generation, Sega kicked ass, and a lot of companies took notes. A lot of electronic companies took notes. They said, man, if Sega doesn't listen to the notes, so can we. Hence, the graveyard consoles in this generation. There's a lot of them. The generation kicked off in 1993 with the FN Town Smarty. I don't have that, but I do have the second console that came after it. A lot of these consoles didn't last long. They last like maybe a year and a half or two, then they pass it on to the next console. That's how it was with the generation. So the second console to come out, and mind you, there were several consoles that came out before. We know the, the fifth generation as the Nintendo 64, the PlayStation, the Sega Saturn. There were consoles that came out before the PlayStation. And if they would have been successful, these would have been the PlayStation before the PlayStation. So understand that, please. So right here, Is the Amiga CD32. I know you have never seen it before. And I know you have never heard of this before. I usually only cover. Consoles that were released in America. This was supposed to be released in America. Never saw the light of day in America though. Why? They were on there. They were on there with, um, to release because of a patent violation. The court was like, "No, no, oh no, no, no! You won't be releasing this here." So they were so sure that they were going to release this console in America, they went and shipped it off to um, Canada. This console was released in Canada. Yeah. But it was mostly released in Britain, Europe, European countries. A lot of Europeans know this console. There's 147 games that were released for the Amiga CD32. And if I didn't tell you this before, Amiga CD32 was made by the company Commodore. Commodore was a computer company. Um, they had made a little plug-in thing with a little laptop. I mean, with a little um, with a keyboard with games built into it. And um, they made a computer set called the Commodore Amiga. They basically slapped a CD drive to it. And made it a console. And you got this. They took the computer line and slapped the CD drive to it and gave us this. I think this is a neat looking console. I love the way this thing looks. I love it. That's the reset button. It has a volume thing. <laughs> Headphone jack. So the controllers. Going to start. This 
<coughs> That's where the controllers go. Controllers go on the side, right there. That's the power button. That's the power button right there. And that's it, folks. <laughs>